one point that I, I really want to emphasize is that there, there is a very heavy genetic determinant of autism. And one way I can emphasize that is to just list for you a number of easily recognized neurogenetic syndromes that are causative or have been associated with, fragile, with uh, autism. Most commonly, Fragile X. Uh, you know that this is the most common cause of mental retardation in uh, institutionalized uh, men and boys. And associated figures, features are macrocephaly, large pinnae, testicular enlargement, hypotonia, joint hyperextensibility. Fragile X, for which I'll show you some uh, better illustrations, may account for somewhere between 3 and 4 percent of autistic spectrum disorders. So it's not the case that most kids who have autism have fragile X, but it is the case that somewhere between 30 and 50 percent of kids who have fragile X are on the autism spectrum. Neurocutaneous syndromes can be causal, notably uh, tuberous sclerosis, which you know for the hypopigmented macules seen on the skin, associated kidney lesions, central nervous system hamartomas, seizures, mental retardation, and attentional disorders. PKU, phenylketonuria, uh, is present on the newborn screening and treatable by dietary therapy, and so it is a preventable cause of autism. Angelman syndrome, uh, is a known cause of autism. It occurs when the maternally expressed UBE3A gene on chromosome 15 is not, it fails to be expressed. Um, what's caused when the paternally derived Prader Willi? Exactly. Okay, so uh, Angelman syndrome, you know, is happy puppet. There's characteristic EEG findings, there's hypotonia, there's spasticity. Uh, and in genetic testing, you need often to do methylation studies to figure out which, uh, to, to, to verify that it is the maternally derived uh, chromosome 15 gene that's not expressed. Rett syndrome, I told you, is one of the uh, pervasive developmental disorders that is not typically included with the ASDs uh, because, again, the gene is known. Uh, I'll show you some illustrations. Um, it affects prim primarily girls, although since the gene has been known, we now know that boys can be affected. It has acquired microcephaly, seizures, and a very characteristic hand-wringing stereotypy. Um, interestingly, the autism of Rett syndrome plateaus and improves even as the other symptoms, breathing abnormalities and seizures, uh, get worse. Smith Lemley Opitz is a rare cause of autism. Uh, it has syndactyly, um, which you know is fusion of the second and third toes and hypotonia. Uh, the reason it's important is I believe it is autosomal recessive and therefore uh, if that is a known cause of autism, genetic counseling is imperative. And then uh, one other less commonly known but probably um, quite important uh, neurogenetic syndrome is P10. Phosphatase intensin homolog uh, is a tumor suppressor gene found on chromosome 10. It is associated with cancers, with non-malignant hamartoma syndromes, and with macrocephaly. And uh, it is advised that macrocephalic children with autism uh, symptoms be screened for P10 even in the absence of tumors. So I just have a couple of illustrations of the single gene disorders associated with autism. Um, Rett syndrome, one in a thousand, one in ten thousand girls, they look normal up until six to eighteen months. They then stop showing normal head growth. They regress in motor skills. Kids who used to be able to turn the pages of a book stop being able to do so, uh, and they begin these clapping or hand wringing. Highly characteristic. If you ever see this, you'll never forget it. Um, and you can you can see the, the posture of the of the hands in these affected girls. They have breathing abnormalities, seizures, sleep disorders. But the autistic features may 
uh, plateau or improve. And again, there is a lot of attention being paid to MECP2 and its role in the expression of genes that alter the development of the, of the nervous system. Fragile X, another single gene disorder known to be associated with autism. <clears throat> Most common genetic cause of autism. One in, one in 4,000 boys and one in 6,000 girls are affected. We know that it is caused by a CGG repeat. Do you know why it came to be called Fragile X? Does anybody know that story? In a lab, <coughs> I believe in Australia, uh, an error was made in the media in which chromosomes were being grown and folate was left out. And it was noticed uh, in, in studies that were screening institutionalized mentally retarded men and boys that the X chromosome would break at one particular spot. And uh, for many years, the way we genetically diagnosed fragile X syndrome was to grow the chromosomes in folate deficient media on a slide, drop the slide, from a height of 10 centimeters and count the number of X chromosomes that were broken. Uh, the same Australian lab, once it replaced its media with media that contained folate, was no longer able to replicate its results. Um, but this did lead to the um, treatment, I, I, I do it, I don't know if it's effective, of treating fragile X patients um, with high doses of, of, uh, of folate. Uh, in any event, it was discovered many years later that we didn't have to drop chromosomes and, and count broken X chromosomes. Uh, we could actually, uh, sorry, we, we didn't have to uh, grow chromosomes in folate deficient media and count their broken Xs. Uh, we could actually analyze DNA for CGG uh, repeats and again, 30% of affected boys are autistic. If we expand the phenotype to include uh, autism spectrum disorders, Asperger's syndrome, et cetera, uh, it's 50 or 60%. And carrier girls may also be autistic. And these are just illustrations of some of the facial features, the elongated facies and the protuberant ears that you might see um, in, in boys with fragile X syndrome. And again, to uh, drive home the P10 story, uh, kids with large head circumferences should be screened for P10 mutations even in the absence of tumors. Um, when I grew up and saw Elephant Man, I thought that he had von Recklinghausen neurofibromatosis. It's uh, subsequently um, been established that he probably had Proteus syndrome, which itself is probably a, a P10 mutation. <clears throat>